How's it going everyone? Now the transfer window is open. All the excitement is building. So we've decided to put together a top five most expensive signings list. In at number five is Darren Bent. Now we signed him in June 2007 for 16.5 million from Charlton. Now, in my opinion, he was a very good striker. He was a little fox in the box. He could score from outside the box as well. He had it all to his game. But he fell out with Harry Redknapp. He missed a notorious header. It was awful. And after the game, Harry Redknapp said, my wife Sandra could have scored that. And ever since, he fell out with the guy. And it was kind of bad because he finished top scorer that season. He was actually decent. But now you can find him in your local Weatherspoons. In at number four is Paulinho. And to this day, we still don't know his first name. So I'm just going to call him Shit Paulinho or Pulinho, whatever you prefer. We signed him in July 2013 for 17 million from Corinthians. Now, here's the problem. It's not actually a problem. He's just trash. Trash, 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 trash personified. He is the definition of trash. He is the worst Brazilian since Lil Zay from City of God. He's awful. In at number three is Son Hyung Min. Now, we signed him in August 2015 for 22 million from Bayer Leverkusen. Now, this guy is Asian Footballer of the Year. Two years in a row, might I add. He's got so much competition for that, that title. Give the guy some props. He's also an LG model. You know LG, the electronics company? Yeah, I'm not bragging, I'm just saying. And he also does it on the pitch as well. He bagged a very important goal against Watford. I like to call him the Watford heartbreaker. He's amazing and he's really going to get a lot of goals for us this season. What a signing. Number two of our top five most expensive signings is none other than Eric Lamella. We signed him in August 2013 for 25.7 million from Roma. The guy, he was, he was known for being a bit of a tricky player. He would pull off stuff. He was very showboaty, flashy. He came here. His haircut is absolutely awful, but he has finally come into his own. He's a workhorse. He's the Rabona specialist. We love him. And hopefully he goes on to score about 100 goals for us from the wing. And number one on our top five most expensive signings, and to be honest, he would top a top five flop list as well, is Roberto Saldado. Now, we signed him in August 2013 for £26 million from Valencia. And, I mean, you know how I feel about the guy. He's awful. You love to call him Bobby, don't you? Oh, Bobby this, Bobby that, he's such a nice guy. So what? Where was the results? Where were the results? That's all I want to see. If there's no results, I do not care. He was awful. He scored about three goals from open play. He was the penalty specialist. He was running around. I remember when he scored that goal and everyone was relieved. He kind of just went, when he scored and ran to the crowd. And we was all like, yeah, he's back. But he wasn't back. He missed a simple through ball for Charlie against Fiorentina. And we went out of the Europa. And I will never forgive him. He can do all the tweets in the world. He can phone call all of our players and try and have a relationship. He can give his shirt number to Harry Kane. I do not care. He's awful and he's a flop and he is our number one most expensive signing. So we need to sign someone else. Let's get him off of this list. Let's sign another five players so we never have to mention the guy again. Anyway, guys, this has been my top five most expensive signings. Um, let me know in the comments below if you agree with it. Do you like any of the players? Do you like Roberto Soldado? Are you deluded? Follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV and somehow keep it casual. Hello, welcome to Spurred On. I'm Rhys James, back for 2016. It is January. That means the January transfer window is open. Hallelujah. And for once, we may need a striker, but for once, we're not praying to the heavens above that we make 10 signings to get a completely new squad. 